and liver. This is, uh, I can't tell you how much I enjoy this dish. I used to hate liver. I, I never enjoyed anything like that. But this is phenomenal, amazing, the best food ever. And also liver is so nutrient dense. It's so good for you. But a lot of people don't like it. They don't know how to cook it. They let it lime water or whatever they do. And I don't know how they do the recipes. But trust me, if you want to have an amazing meal, this you can have for your first meal of the day, second meal of the day, third meal of the day, you'll have the best body of your life. Trust me. Right, let me show you what I've got here. So I've got some rosemary and some thyme on there that I'm going to use for my flavoring. And then, of course, I've got my beef. Now, this is the best beef that I could find, cube beef. Um, so this is great for frying and it's soft, it's tender, it's really nice. Calf's liver over there. So there is my rosemary and my thyme on there. And then I've also got some red onion with a bit of garlic that I've chopped up in there. It's, it's fresh garlic, okay? Then I'm going to flavor this. I'll be using some sea salt or Himalayan salt in that. And then I've got ground cumin. So that gives it just an unbelievable flavor. But to top it off is the garam masala, garam masala, sorry. Put that in and that is what makes this flavor so great. It is just, when you flavor your food, it's nice. You can eat it, you enjoy it, and you actually get good results, okay? Not this, um, I don't like my diet type of thing. We don't diet, people, we do not diet. That's the reason why we get results. Well, by the way, and there you go, I'm not gonna drink this. There's a bit of red wine there, just a cheap red wine that I'm just gonna pop in at the end, just to kind of simmer the meat in there for a little bit. It gives it that nice, thick sauce but it it just it just kind of tops the flavor then most of the alcohol will cook away but this is beautiful this is just honestly you got to try it you got to try it in order to know what it's about so let's cook let's get healthy and um yeah let's just enjoy food for once okay here we go butter is all melted now we're going to add the onions and the garlic i'm doing this on a medium heat not on a high heat Add that in, and then I'm gonna fry that for a few minutes. Right, onions have been frying for about four minutes. Now I'm gonna add in the beef. And it smells amazing. Flavor the beef with some sea salt. Beef has been frying for about four minutes as well. Um, it's not properly cooked yet. Now I'm gonna add in the cumin. So this is just the powder stuff, the ground cumin powder. And I want some really nice flavor to this. Run out, nice, last bit. Now the masala. This gives, it's almost like a real kind of extra sweet flavor that it gives to the beef but it's sensational, this stuff. Really nice with beef. Give it a stir. And it's the smell, that's the thing, is the smell is just unbelievable. Now, I've not added in the liver yet. I'll wait till the end because I don't want to overcook the liver too much. I still want the liver to be soft, not rubbery. This is the thing, a lot of people cook their food and it does not taste nice. It just, it's so bland, it's, there's no flavor to anything, so I don't know how they eat it. If you eat tasty, delicious food, you'll find that you actually eat less because you're satisfied. You don't constantly have to snack on anything and you enjoy what you're doing. Now again, the beef has been cooked for another four minutes or so after I've added in my flavoring and now I'm going to add in the liver. But I'm also going to take down the heat uh, because I don't want everything to overcook. I'm going to add in my rosemary and thyme some of my videos, so I say partially, keep on getting it wrong. Okay, so this liver will cook really quickly, okay? Now I turn down the heat. Take it on a really low heat. And then I add in my thyme. And then also the rosemary. And so just kind of spread it out. And you can have a look in a sec. After another couple of minutes, everything is now cooked almost properly. The, the liver is still kind of soft. It's not overly done. Well, it's not overdone, sorry. Now we're going to add in this red wine. 
and don't put in expensive red wine and that just creates that sauce that I'm going to pour over my food at the end. This is what it's all about, I said to you, flavor, flavor, flavor. And I'm just going to let this simmer for a while, give it a stir until the sauce thickens up and then it's time to serve up but I'll let you have a quick look, see what it looks like. Stunning meal, this is so tasty, there you go. But a sauce is just simmering on a very, very low heat. But the smell, I said it so many times in the video, the smell is amazing. Turn off the heat, it's all done. So that dish is so quick. Now, if you want to do it properly, I, maybe about 12 to 14 minutes, because you want, you want it to simmer for a while in order to kind of make a little bit more kind of juice, to thicken it up in the, in the sauce bit. You don't just want to kind of rush your food. That's also another problem. Too many people rush their food and never taste nice. So the heat off, give it a stir, and now I'm going to serve it up. That's what quality food looks like. So there's the onions in there, got the garlic flavor, the masala, the cumin, bit of that red wine sauce in there. It is, this is just a stunning, stunning meal. It, the, the smell is unbelievable, but you got to make it yourself in order to uh, to experience it. It's easy and it's tasty. Good food can be absolutely phenomenal if you know how to cook it. These are little guidelines and what you can do. And I mean, that's that's just it. I'll have the meal and for hours and hours and hours and hours I won't be hungry because I'm not snacking and I don't need that extra bit. People that constantly snack is because they don't eat that well and they also don't eat food that's really nutritious. This is a proper nutritious meal and it makes you feel good. So quality food, real food, natural food, that's what it's all about. Enjoy it, have fun with it and keep watching these videos because I'll keep on bringing them out. I want you to see these beautiful recipes, try it out and just see how your stomach will disappear. So I'll catch you soon, bye.